Ladies, gentlemen, gamers, welcome to the stream. Hello, hello, good morning, good evening, good night, wherever you are, welcome. I hope you guys are all doing well. I know I am. And Sable, Sable, we're still here. It's Sable, it's time for Sable. Today's goals, learn how to fish. And hopefully, 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 if I can find it, find the, wherever, like the chum cave or something, whatever I have to do to deliver the chum eggs so I can get upgrades. I can get climbing upgrades and such. Cause I'm struggling. I'm struggling my friends. Uh, and I need more stamina. And hopefully from what I've heard, what I've been told, what I've seen, that is where I must go. Um, otherwise, hello, hello, greetings. Hello, how are you doing today? I, I would say it's a good morning, but I, I, just warning, because if it were a good morning, I'd be fishing. See, that bit is made funnier by the fact I've been fishing and I fucking hate it. <laughs> fishing is, fishing in video games. Why is my controller not? Hey, hey, bud. Why are you not? Why are we not? Why are we not? Working. Did it die? Or did it just turn off for some reason? I think it just turned off because I hadn't used it in a bit. Okay. That's alright. That's alright. That's alright. Um Hold on. Hold on. It's me! It's me, I'm here! Now, I think last we left off, we had just, um, where's the map? We had just been over to the worm, the worm, the worm. And I don't think we ended up finding anything there. I think we just kind of looked at stuff and then nothing came of it. Oh, oh, as usual, tell me how the sound is, because I, I never know. I never know how the sound in games is. What? Quests. Because I remember... Me, 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 Okay, so I have two, I have two quests that want me to go to the wash. And so I think that is a good place for us to go to. As well, before we even head over there, I know I saw a cartographer briefly in this direction, but we ended up going to the worm instead of to him. Yep. So let's head over there. And hopefully I can reach him. Again, my stamina is not uh, great right now. Hopefully I can get up there. If not, I might have to go looking for the um, chum cave or whatever. I'm not quite sure. There's something off in the distance over there. I should not be getting distracted. What is that? Oh, that's something I don't even have on the map. <laughs> How curious. Okay. So what do we, what shenanigans do we got going on over here? How do I, how do I get up this thing? Cause there's like lips. So I don't know how I'm gonna get over those. Hmm. Hmm. Strange. Curious, even. Okay. What? <coughs> okay. I don't know if I have enough stamina to make that. Which is an issue, unless... 
Oh, unless they give me a beautiful, lovely bridge to get up there. Making it easy for me. Oh, what a lovely little jaunt they've given me. Oh, how kind! I think? I Yeah, I was about to say, I think I should have enough stamina. Hmm... Yeah! It's all coming together. Oh yeah, there's definitely- there's something over there! And there's... tents and such. I'll have to investigate those on the way down. What a jaunty tune! Okay. Hello? Can I not? Can I not climb this? Hello? No, 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 because why can't I climb it? Huh? Huh? Okay, but I can climb this. Weird, strange, whatever. Whatever. Ooh. Ooh. This is lovely. This is so curious looking. <coughs> Things. Things for me. Money for me. <gasps> Worm for me. Don't mind if I do. Thank you. All right. Oh, chalk butterfly. Oh, I need this. I need this to give to the vivarium person. Okay. Hello. My presence surprises the cartographer, which in turn surprises me. Whoa, where'd you come from? You shouldn't sneak up on people like that. It's not worth explaining. I clearly came from below. Can I buy a map? Here's what I have. Cartographer's bike wings. Ooh. And I already have the mask, so I don't need that. I am kind of... Why am I, like, actually broke right now? Oh, because I bought all the bike parts. Right, 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 right. What can I find in this region? I ask what I can find in this region, and they seem thrilled to be discussing this with me. The petrified forest is wonderful. If you venture inside, you might see some of the gigantic geodistic stones. And who know and knows what fun creatures you might find lurking nearby. Then marrow bone stations tucked safely beneath the bones of an ancient giant. They say that last bit with some added flair. I appreciate their theatricality. Oh, and if you have never seen the watch, well, let me just say there are a few engineering feats quite as resonant. And finally, Parusta, the great worm. Most people will tell you it's just some ancient monument. Sort of tribute to something. But I think it may have been alive once. Interesting. Thanks. Now, let us... Oh, there is another worm. I knew there had to be something else down here. Gift? Gift for me? Worm for me? I love the chum so much. I just like their designs, in general. Nothing over here? Okay. Where is Samoon? Where did I park Samoon? Samoon, my best friend Samoon? Somewhere. She's somewhere on here. Oh, I just parked her higher up the hill. Okay. See, what's over here? Is this... What direction is this? Oh, yeah. This is something I have not been to. Oh, I'm so curious! I love learning! I love finding new things! Oof. 
plant. I don't think I've ever seen that color plant before. Whoa. This is cool. What's going on here? Okay. What does the sign say? Uh, North Petrified Forest, West Center of Brunswick, Northwest Marabone Station, and uh, also Northwest Rooster's Ruin. I guess this is the center of Brunswick? Because it's the only thing that I didn't recognize on that list. Hmm. place looks cool. I love all the, like, ancient ruins you can find in this. Oh, no, this is the watch. Oh! I see. Anything else? Ugh. Creeping in here. Any other curiosities for me? No? I like the vibe of this place. It's pretty cool. <gasps> Snatched! Gotcha! No? I needed to take a reading. It said. Did I just select the... Uh... Hmm. Okay. Oh, I guess it's because I need... It. One quest needs me to go to the watch, which is where I am, and one needs me to go to the wash. And I just... <laughs> I just didn't read it properly. Okay. Well, we're here. Whoa, that's sick. There has to be something like down here as well. No, some secrets, perhaps a bug, a chalk butterfly. Is this place just, like, tilted slightly? Is that what's going on here? Because it, it feels strange. Like, the movement feels weird, and I can't decipher why. Oh. And hop. Ooh. Ooh. Interesting. Interesting. And a face. Okay, what shenanigans are going on here? What, 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 what? Snatched. Ooh, Azura die. Very nice. Oh, there's the explanation thing. <gasps> oh! Whoa. A flash of light shines off of something behind my eye, and a piece of knowledge forms in my mind. The sunstone manifests when the machinery is in its place. When the sun casts shadows, provide the stone with the answer it seeks. So, it does cast shadows. What does that mean? It's this. This is the answer it seeks, but what do I do with that? Huh? There's shenanigans afoot and I don't quite understand. Well, let me go back up there because I see other platforms with other, um... 
instruction masks, so. Is there anything? <gasps> Warm. I was about to say, is there anything behind here? Yes, there is. <laughs> All right. So there's this platform. I'm not sure I'll have the stamina to make it up this, but we'll see. Oh, there's a lip? Motherfucker. Okay. Okay. Hmm. No, because now it's different. What the fuck? There's something else. Does it shift? Hmm. Hmm. I wish there was a faster way to get back up there. Cause like, I see the little things and I just don't know how I'm supposed to interact with them. Unless, 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 unless. This like doesn't seem to do anything. I can't interact with these. It's like it looks like I need an object. What I need though stands to be seen. There's let's go back up. I just realized it connects to another one and I haven't been over here. So, let, let, uh, why not? Let's go take a look. See if it maybe provides me some useful information. Hopefully. Uh, fingers crossed. Oh, there we go. What the fuck? Okay. Mm -hmm. Curious. There's shenanigans afoot. So I assume we want them to be blue. So... There's also that. We either want them to be blue or we want them to be yellow. And I'm not sure which. How do we do that? That didn't work. Ah, there you go.
My question is, how do we get over to the last bit? Oh god. Is this enough? Like, maybe we go over to the next one. That should be enough, like, vantage. Yeah! Look at that. Nothing. Oh. Ooh. Okay. Well, that did something. Let's take a little peek -see at this bad boy. What do we have going on here? Oh! Oh! Uh, oh! Well, if it wants me to just remember the pattern, I do. I'm on some other shit. I'm built different, I know. Oh, ah! <laughs> I don't know if that works. Let me see what happens if I go up here and stand on the thing now. The sunstone manifests when the sun casts shadows. Provide the stone with the answer it seeks. Hmm. What? <laughs> surely, surely it doesn't want me to just put it in all of them. Surely not. Yeah, surely not. I just threw one down there. I'm confused. that fucking noise there's no like there is there is in fact shenanigans afoot 
there is there is there is there is and there's nothing going on going down on the there's nothing going on here mm. Mm, mm, mm. curious 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 Maybe if I move the little hands again. Let's get back up here. This is cool as fuck though. Hmm. All right, so what happens now? Oh, I can't even I can't even move them. So that's definitely not what I need to do. Should I like watch the sunrise or something to get an accurate reading? Is that what it wishes of me? I keep forgetting that I can't run while holding them and that if I do it'll just you know throw them Oof. I'm hoping it just wants me to put them in order per se or just go left to right because if not then mmm Let me sit and watch the sun here for a minute. Nothing. Nothing. What if it's just, is it, what's the first one that showed up? I think the first one was this little leafy thing. If we, what if we just do that? What then, huh? Riddle me that, Batman. Nothing.
Hmm. Or maybe I do have to wait till daytime because what 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 in game time is it? I don't know. I don't know how to tell time. <laughs> uh, oh my back. Okay. Okay. Is there anything? Is there anything that tells me? I feel like that's doing something, but I don't know what. Hmm. Oh, 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 where am I? Yeah, I mean, I. The moon. I guess we do have to wait till sometime? Till daytime? Why did I say sometime? That's absurd. My little sunstone. What if I just try all of them? Like, individually. Nothing. Nothing. That didn't make a noise. But also didn't do anything. Okay. Yeah, you're not making a noise. Open. Open says me. Open says me. Do 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 do. Do 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 <gasps> Oh god <sighs> Yeah, there's nothing think the sun will rise soon i guess maybe i just was in a bad situation in which huh i i i came right before sundown so i didn't uh get access oh there we go the sun is rising the light is cascading i am twiddling my thumbs
<laughs> Fucking there we go. I did just do it at a bad time, I guess. Whoa. Whoa. In front of me, some kind of projection appears, as if by magic, and in its floating geometry, I see the lights that blaze in the night sky. I see where we came from. As I focus on each element of this complex visualization, I realize that there's something being imparted to me, that I am reading and understanding things. Knowledge comes in new, yet feels innate, as though I am being reminded rather than taught. I decide to put my focus toward... Ooh... The sun. I can see clearly that the large glowing orb in the center is our sun, and so blindingly bright that I cannot look directly into it without feeling its heat radiate within my skull. Around it, celestial bodies move in a rhythmic dance. I decide to put my focus toward the small planet nearest the sun, Emmis, and her two moons flit about the sun like moths, dancing over flame. The goat-headed god, patron of the Abexi. Her wisdom and resolve made for some of my very favorite stories growing up. She always seemed more accessible than the other gods. My teachers would say that Emmas is who we look to when Rohana is too preoccupied for us. I pictured her on a cliff above the Ewer, ever patient, ever open. They also said that through certain masks, one could see her shadow on the sun. I decide to put my focus towards a second planet. The second planet is Midden, our sandy little home of an unremarkable rock, made warm and vibrant by the power and energy of the Perpetual. Looking at it in this way, I can see another side of the Perpetual and cannot help but notice that we look ensnared and imprisoned by it, held in its grasp. A cold wind passes, but warms as I respond myself, no, we are not being possessed, we are being protected. I offer myself that comfort. I decide to put my focus towards an unknown geometry. I look upon a shape that I struggle to describe. It is pure and strange geometry, so bizarre and yet so orderly that it cannot be organic. I know immediately that this is the maw. This is the impossible thing that birthed the whale. I know from stories, from history, and from the knowledge that seeps into my brain here that this was made by living things, sentient ones, with plans and intentions. But even though I know it, I cannot fathom it. Its scale is incomprehensible. The magnitude of it is such that, even in replica, I cannot look at it for long. Something in me loathes it. I don't know why. I decide to put my focus toward the glittering ring. Oleon. A glittering ring of golden dust. Every little fleck looks as though it's floating on a breeze, gently through the sky. Are these what make up the stars? I decide to put my focus towards the ringed planet, which is the one over there. Carib and his wings. When I picture it, the ringed planet is populated entirely by beetles, living in a decidedly advanced society. It would be the perfect place for Saima, I think, but I don't love the thought of it myself. It looks larger than the other planets. There would be a lot of beetles. Time to move on. I decide to put my focus towards the twin planets. The twin fish, coral and cobalt. They seem to be small moons caught in their currents. The way they move is mesmeric, and it's hard to look away. It is said that these two are the most mischievous of the gods, and I recall the legends of them disguising themselves as children to lure kind nomads into the undercurrent of the dunes. Among the Abexi, the stories of the twins are perfect for scaring the too bold and too young at adventuring too far from home. It's a wonder we ever get on with our gliding. Part of me wishes I had not recalled those fishes, though, and it'll be a challenge not to look askance at the next errant child I meet. I decide to put my focus towards... I'm done here. That's cool. I love learning. Oh, this lore is so interesting. Mechanist trousers. Ooh. And this looks like a astronaut. Mmm. 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 What the hell is that? There's noises, there's noises happening. Hello? Oh, I guess it might have just been the thing moving. So, I think... 
Hold on, let me look at the map really quick. Ooh, we're here. I think we've seen most everything in this area down here. So I say let's pop back to Marbone Station, complete the quest, and then go up here for or wherever for the next one. Maybe stop through the petrified forest on our way. Where am I? Where am I going? I'm going here. Hmm. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, I didn't realize that this is a little mini version of it. How cute. Samoon. Samoon, I shall like to leave. Complete my quests and such. <laughs> Samoon! My best friend, Samoon! There you are! Hell yeah. I'm so glad I got these parts. And that Samoon's just a, the tiniest bit faster. It's lovely. That's the worm. I don't see anything else. Or anything much out there. <sighs> I do plan to return to the worm though. They, there, one thing I noticed was that there was a pool of water in it. Um, and seeing as nearby is where they're like, you, you can, you can fish, you can learn how to fish. Uh, I think I'm going to learn how to fish and go back there and fish something up. All right. I think it was the mechanics who I needed to talk to. Klon says hello. Have you taken a reading yet, Glider? Yes, I opened the door. And you saw what's inside, yes? There was a model. Yes, yes! Oh, that is so what I had hoped you'd say. What a solve. Well done, Glider. You must be tremendously proud of yourself, using that little gliding mind of yours. I skirt past little to ask if what I saw helps them. Immensely, more than you know, for reasons I, well, suffice to say it helps me, with a few calculations and considerations of my own. But why are you asking about me? Did you learn anything? I pondered the perpetual. I tell them I found myself perplexed with the perpetual, considering its re relationship to us. Fascinating. I can tell Kalan has long moved on. I'm not sure why they ask me anything, really. But I'm glad to see them producing my prize. Here's your badge. Worth it with pride. Okay. Stuttering. Very much stuttering. Stuttering. Um... I'm almost at beetle badge point. So let's go do the last beetle quest. Some orange three ringed beetles. Um, and then we can come back and get two masks. My goal for progression in this game is I will not end it until I get all of the masks I can. <laughs> I don't think I need to 100% it, but I do want all of the masks. I'm dedicated. Sand dune. Almost looks like salt. Mm -hmm. Whoa. Sick. Uh, okay. 
Okay. Oof. Don't lose your bike. I'm on it. I won't lose it. I'm on it. Is this... Okay, it is sand. I thought it was water for a second. I was like, um... Whoa. Ah. Ow. <laughs> Whoa. There's shenanigans afoot. Not even shenanigans, there's just items. There's items and things afoot. There's a foot afoot, perhaps. Ah, it appears that another ship has long since crashed here. You- Why can I not catch you, little freak? Oh, you can't climb it? Oh! What a shame. Let me go back around. I can definitely get up there. Uh, it's just gonna take me a little bit. Anything interesting? Loot, perhaps? Money, perhaps? No? Mm. No, what shenanigans is going on over here? Okay, I need to put something there. Aha, and there's a climbing wall. Perfect. And the door's not even open. Never mind. <laughs> It would be great if I could get into it. And this needs a battery. Which... I don't know where one is. Or would be. Hmm. Oh, there are some beetles. Some beebles. Hello, creature. Oh, you're skittish. Is there any... Mm, okay, there's no tips on how to get them. Which is great. I'm assuming... That has something to do with the fruit on these trees over here. Because it was like that in the very first area. And I can't climb them. Hmm. Oh, I can climb them. I just couldn't climb that specific one I was on, I guess. How do I even collect these? Hmm. <laughs> Unless I can creep up on them. But I doubt it. Hey! Okay, yep. Hmm. I don't know if it wants me to, like, jump down on them. That might work. But also, like, I feel like they would just still see me coming. Hmm. Hmm.
not seeing anything that would really help me. Let me go back up. There could be... Oh, here's another part of the ship. I was going to say, there could be something in the ruin ship parts that could help me. If I could get into them. So let's see if there's anything interesting over here. There's 20 buckaroos. And not much else. This is a cool area. I wonder if I could get some moon up there. Where there's a will, there's a way. <laughs> God damn it, if I don't have the will, I'll find a fucking way. Okay. Perhaps there's something on top of this uh, platform over here. Butterfly and some money. Hmm. Hmm. So I can't grab this one. <laughs> I saw that circle there for a second. Mix squeeze me. Perhaps is there Aha No. No, I thought I was gonna be able to get in there. Okay. No batteries or anything for me. What's up with this? Oh, I'm just, I'm just stupid. The issue is that I'm just stupid. <laughs> Let's not talk about that. Let's not let. How long does it take for it to... Yeah, let me recover my uh, stamina. Let's, let's not, let's not worry about um, my errant stupidity. Nor the fact that it seems I don't have enough stamina to um, Oh, no, I do. Okay. I had just enough. Perfect. Perfect. Beautiful. There's nothing over here. Am I in the... I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm just past the, um... Oh, good lord. Where am I? I'm just past the petrified forest. If that helps cement where I am at all. I don't think I'm near a weird tower. I did not recall I do not recall seeing a tower of sorts around here. So is there anything else besides the battery? For Ma? Oh god, the clipping is woo. Yeah. I'm trying to catch beetles. I'm on a little bit- oh, there is something for me. I barely saw that. I'm on a beetle hunt. But they don't like me. Oh god. 
Oof. No, 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 no. Guess I did not need Simoon up there in the first place, which is kind of annoying, but whatever. Okay. There we go. Give me something to catch beetles? Question mark? Either give me Saren or give me something to catch beetles. Oh. Okay, well, it's close. No, 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 it, it doesn't beat, it doesn't, it doesn't meet the crystal farmer drip. That's like, actually unreal. Okay, no beetle catching tips. Nothing there either. Was that it? Hmm. Hmm. All right, sure. Samoon, my best friend Samoon. How did you get there? <laughs> how, how fast do I have to be to catch a beetle? Apparently that's not fast enough. All right, all right, all right. How am I, how? Riddle me this sable. How am I supposed to catch these goddamn beetles? I don't have a plan. Oh! Is that. Did I pick that up? Or did it just disappear? Erm. Um, Erm. Um, I don't know. I don't know. There was something there. Did it get knocked down? Aha. Ah. Ha, 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 ha. I see. I understand. I get it. I know what's up. You want some beetle food? I got some beetle food. Fools. Get your fucking ass. Come over here, boy. I got beetle food. I got beetle food for you. Eat the eat the fucking beetle food, man. You are actually These beetles are actually just getting on my nerves. <laughs> okay. What now? No worries. Life is hard. And these beetles are annoying. Like, oh, will they come to me if I hold them? No. Is it, I can't tell what's sand and what's like rock. I guess this is rock. I would assume. Oh, you want it so bad? You want it so bad? Are you hungry? Ah, loser! Idiot! Idiot meal! Stupid ass! You can't win. That feels good. I'm- I'm not- I'm qu not quite cl- I'm not- Quite clever enough today. Dude's fucking scaling that shit. God damn. Is there. Where else? Where else is there beetles? Oh, bro, I got beetle suit, bro. I got the good shit. You wanna come over here? I got beetle food. Yeah. Okay, whatever. Whatever, whatever, whatever. Meh, meh, meh. 
probably just set it there. Oh, they're both going for it. Hell yes. I need... I think four of these souls. I need three for the quest and then... I want... A fourth one for, um... The Vivarium. <laughs> Stupid. Oh, you want the beetle food so bad? Oh, you want it so bad it makes you look stupid. Go on. <laughs> do I have four? How many do I have? Erm. Erm, erm, erm. I do have four. Okay, perfect. Samoon, my best friend Samoon. We are going to go here. Oh, ow. Where am I going? Okay. That makes sense. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Bumpy roads. Ooh, what are these? Mystery glowing blue things? Can I pick them up? What it what am I holding? What is this? Who are you? What are you? Oh No more but oh this is the plant thing. Oh That's cool. Butterfly for me. <laughs> On. Captured. That's... It's a little broken. <laughs> That's so cool. I think current goal is go to the station. Um, turn in the beetle quest, then go to the vivarium, turn in the bugs we do have, and then perhaps go learn how to fish. Oh, oh. Okay. <laughs> Excuse me. Ow. Oh. Uh. Okay. <laughs> All right. I got you something! I got you something! Not the beetles, I got something else! Amazing! 
Elizabeth is wrapped in wonder. Butterflies, who knew? If you'd given me a thousand chances, I'd never have guessed. I love butterflies, don't you? They flit across the world along their own little paths, dancing alone on the wind, but they seem so pleased whenever they meet up. Like us, I think. A bit like us, I think. She looks out at the horizon again. Thank you again. You're a wonder, and please take this. Another badge for the Namur picking butterfly wrangling young glider who's been so helpful. I take the badge and put it away. I always thought guards were stern and stoic, but Elizabeth is bright joyful. It is powerful. Next on my list, I've got Hokoa. Decided it was worth making the trip. Wish me luck, and I'll wish our paths to cross again. I have a feeling they will. Oh, that's so sweet. Oh, that's so sweet. Ow. Beetle! Beetle-liker! Bug-liker! I have things for you! Greetings, Glider. What can I do for you? I hand the innkeeper my collected beetles and she claps a little before taking them aside and s taking them and setting them gently aside. Well done! Hope this was one was fun for you, and if it wasn't, well, you've still earned a nice badge for your trouble. I thank the innkeeper for the badge and go on my way. Cool! I didn't know that I was going to be getting another guard uh, thing. So I think I will be getting three masks. Hello? Can I not? Oh, the atmosphere in the tent is tense, uncomfortable. Claim the mechanist's mask. I show my mechanist badges to the mask caster. Mask, mask, mask. This mask caster looks much less threatening than the other one. Give me my mask. Give me my mask. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, hold on. I have to see how this thing looks. Oh, that's sick. Sick as fuck. Probably my favorite, like, career mask so far. It, it definitely goes with the fit. It definitely goes with the fit. We're kind of we're kind of suited up right now. Beautiful. Get in there, boy. Which one was this? This is either beetles or guards. I think it was the beetle one that I just grabbed. Oh no, it's the guards one. Okay. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme, gimme! I love collecting things! I love collecting things so much! Oh yeah. Oh yeah. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? <sighs> what is it? Show me.
The Hercules Beetle Mask. Hell yes. So, which... The, the Beetle Mask is really sick. Well, let me try this on. I like the fact that it, it like, moves. Oh, it's so cool. I love all the mask designs in this, but I think... I think the Mechanists, Beetle Mask, and Shade of Ecrea ones are, are, are top three for me as of right now. Badges. Psst, psst, psst. So out of the ones I have, I just need two more climbing badges. And I think went with the Beetle Mask. Solid. I think I'm going to stick with the Mechanist one right now just because the blue in it or the blue on the sides of it kind of matches the crystals. Um, and what would I be without having a matching outfit, honestly? Um, you can fast travel? There's actually no way. <laughs> You're telling me I played this game for eight hours and I didn't know you can fast travel? That's actually absurd. I've been I've been going I, I I've been driving everywhere. <laughs> oh god. That's Key fast travel anywhere that has like a marker? That's absurd! I'm actually a little mad at that! That's absurd! We're like five stream like four or five streams into this, and I just realized I can fast travel. Hello again, Sable. I have things for you. How do I give you things? Oh, hand and some butterflies. Thanks, Sable. I'll put these in the tanks. Um, goodbye. I guess she only takes butterflies. I guess I don't need the beetles. Can I see the butterflies? Where are they? We'd like to take a little peek. Um. Hello? They're somewhere around here. I'll see them eventually. I'm still so pissed off about that. There's actually, there's actually no way. Oh, maybe this is where the glow ones are or not. I don't know. I feel like, I don't think they ever mention expressly you can do that. I feel like I, I've played enough video games over my lifespan that I should know that there's probably fast travel. It's a little embarrassing that I didn't. <laughs> okay, I don't know where they are. Whatever. Whatever. Well, that makes my life just a million times easier. I've been putting off quests because I'm like, oh, I don't want to spend the like six minutes it's going to take me to uh, drive over there. God forbid I actually clicked on something. Okay. Well. <laughs> well, if we have that, let's just... Oh, and I don't even have one over here. Well, fuck me, I guess. I don't remember what the, like... What's the closest thing there? Hercules Beetle Nest. Woo, woo. Why not? Mm. Pissing me off. <laughs> Alright. Where's the moon? Okay. My, um... Mmm. Just, mmm. Mm -hmm. 
No, it's just a straight shot, I guess. Woo! Okay. I guess it's that thing in the distance. Ooh, what's that? Is that? Oh, I got that's the entrance to the Ebexy shit. I'm not going there yet. Oof. Hopefully, I have uh, enough stamina to get up there. I'm slowly but surely finding that I'm struggling on the stamina front and that I do need to find the chum cave. Um, yet I'm making no effort to do such thing. All right. All right, all right, all right. Hmm. Okay. Oh! Oh, how lovely! They've given me a nice little bridge! Ah, look at that! I loathe to think how long I've had this quest for. <laughs> They're like, oh yeah, you and yeah. Second second day you're gliding. How fun. Here, come come help me fix this wind turbine. And I leave for for weeks, for months. And I don't fix it. Look at this little guy. He's so joyous. Mm-hmm. Shit. There we go. There we go. Ooh, can I go in here? Ooh. Any secrets? Nothing. Nothing too important. I wish I could break all those little glass, like, bottles and things that they have in the environment. I don't know if it's, like, the the Legend of Zelda instinct, but I, I see a glass bottle, I need to shatter it. Same instinct as seeing a tall thing and needing to climb it. If I can make it up there, which I cannot. Okay. Okay. It's all right. I'll find it eventually. The wind tower. Woo. Oh, this sounds pretty. I love wind chimes. Big, uh... Big, uh, wind chime head. Oh, fuck. Forgot- I forgot you can't jump when you're climbing. Once again, the, uh... Legend of Zelda instinct fucks me. What? Is there a gap there? Frankly absurd. Mm -hmm. 
bouldering top, though they won't help me climb further. The hand wraps and lightweight fit of this gear are great for making scaling mountain heights more comfortable. Ooh. Okay. Oh, oh, okay. Took a little tumble. We're okay. What's down there? Not much. All right. Get back into here. There is a higher ladder that I'm intrigued with. Okay. Huh. This looks cool. Where are we going? Oh! Yep. There's sure shit something stuck up there. A spider? A rock? Oh, that's lovely. Secrets? Secrets for me? Secrets for me and items for me? Secrets and items and things? Where was that? Mechanist top. Oh, oh, yeah. Hold on. I'm stop stretching. Kind of a fit. I have to stick with a Hakoan top. It's so cool. It's so cool looking. Oop. Uh, head back to Utari. Yeah, which is here. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Let's head there. And I don't even I, I, I don't even have to walk there anymore. I have to I don't have to ride Smoon. I can just Ah. Who this way? Oh, it's this way. Utara greets me warmly. How may I help? Utara's delight is obvious, and I see it even in my approach. They radiate with energy. You did it, thank you! And well done, both of you. Did you have much trouble? None at all. Of course not, and why would you? You were meant to do it. Now for your... I want a reward. Now for what you're owed. Utari produces a mechanis batch, holding it out for me to take. You may have been late in coming, but here you are where you are meant to be. I give you this badge not only in recognition of where you have been and what you have done, but in honor of one of many possibilities. That you may, if so you choose, become one of us, who speak the unheard language of Samoon and her vast connections. The badge is one, is but one, and you will need to earn more. Yeah, guess what? I already have the mask! From others who carry them. But if and when you do, the caster will know what you've chosen and you may wear the mask of the mechanist. I thank Utari for it and tell them I have much to consider. For just a faint moment, I hear the faintest ringing in my left ear. Distant and deep, like a river below the sands. Listen. Oh. Oh, and Simoon's all nice and parked. Okay. Um. I need to ask this person. Hello. Well, Met Glider. Uh, okay, never mind. Who do I need to speak to? Someone over here, perhaps? Is there- there is- yeah, there's someone at this station. 
It's just the question is where at the station? Not down there, I can assure you. Maybe the innkeeper question mark? Do you know where Lahore is? Ah, oh, you're looking for Lahore. Love her. She's great. Think last I heard she was on her way to the Sodics. Big place. Go to a place to empty the old thought bucket. I thank her for the help. Anything else I can help you with? Nope. At 7th, 5th, 3rd. And there's a scrapper here. Of which I have many a piece of loot for. If I remember, he's down there, okay. Oh! I have things for you! I've collected much scrap! Alton barely looks up at me. Got any good scrap? Sell scrap metal. Damn! <laughs> I fetch everything I found for him, handing it over piece by piece. Alton looks up at the ceiling. I have to say, I wasn't expecting much out of you. I wait for the next bit. For slightly too long. But this is a good haul. Here, take these. Alton reaches into his pocket and tosses me two scrapper badges. One of them is a little dirty, but I pretend not to notice. Good job. Keep it up. Okay, so if I bring them even more, then I could get... Ah, I see. Or, 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 I understand. So... So, 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 is there back interest to this? Can I break in? Can I break in and take his money? <laughs> okay. Map check. Where have I not been? Mm. Oh, good lord. Um. Bridge at the Betrayed. Well, Agria. This place seems kind of empty. What is this? What does that mean? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> okay, so. We have all of that. Let's... How do we get up there? Do we just go around? I would assume so, but I don't want to, like... I don't want to get locked into an ending accidentally, you know? But I'm trying to think where... Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. This place seems too empty. And I don't know what those are. Can I teleport there? Or is it just like... There were things! There were things here a second ago. They're gone. Oh no, they're here. The, um... Okay. What are- what are these? I'm curious. I'm curious. Let's take a look. Whoa. Why are you out there? It is this way. What? Is that maybe places where I found... Uh, worm bees? It could be. I, I genuinely don't recognize the marker. We'll head over there, though. We'll be curious. Why not? Why not? Ouch. Ouch. What the hell is that? What, uh, what, what am I looking at? What is that? Hold on. I place something right there. Where is that? No, that's just in the middle. And okay, let's go to the blue one and then we'll go to the red one. 
Because that is a strange looking object. So, it, I guess there's, it's just a tower? It's just a tower? Nothing else? No, um, uh, shenanigans? Perhaps? I feel like there should be something here. I guess not. What if I climb this? Riddle me that. Oh, I guess it is warm, warm markers. But that doesn't, doesn't quite help me. Okay, well. I want to find, I want to find the, uh, the chum thing. I need to find something to do with these little eggies. I want more stamina. Wah. Okay, what's this thing over here? And what's that over there? Yeah, what the hell is this? Angler hut. Oh, is this the guy who teaches me how to fish? I was looking for you. More than once, Simoon has slowed over a dune without my asking, or taken an expected but gentle curve around an invisible something. And I've wondered if she's drawing from a memory of a time before. But lately, if I wondered if she lately, I've wondered if she's tuning into another different flow altogether, the movements of fish as they swim below the sands. I approach the angler with this in mind, and think how interesting it must be to find one's calling in fishing and reaching out for things one cannot see. Might even teach me some patience. Hello there, glider. What can I do for you? What do I want to talk about? Cassie says hello. Cassie. I can hear the furrow in his brow, and then he brightens. Cassie! You know Cassie! How is she? I tell Yoshi Cassie's doing brilliantly, and that her vivarium is making a lovely start of it. That's great to hear, you know, hmm. She mentioned me, yeah? What'd she say? She said you were very kind, Yoshi nods. That's nice of her, and honestly, I'm happy to hear that. Always worried she thought she failed me or something because she wasn't much for fishing. Who cares, I say. The chum lair? I believe so. Welcome in as well. Some sort of place where the chums must go? I just wanted her to do what she loved, and it sounds like she is. I think I'll go by the Vivarian sometime and say hello myself. Thanks for that, Glider. I tell him it's a pleasure. Teach me how to fish, please. I'd like to learn how to fish. The angler nods. Fancy the angler, Maske. Hope you're more patient than some of these gliders. I'm working on that. I'm certain he smirks. Hmm. Well, either way, the first thing you'll need is a fishing rod. And I'll give you one of my old ones. Good for a trainee. Take this. You can use this to cast off anywhere you find. You can find some sand. Anywhere? Anywhere. Whether you get a bite or not will be another matter. But that's the trick of being an angler. Feeling it out. I nod. So if you want to earn the mask, that's how you do it. I'm not here to waste your time if you're not here to waste mine. For your first badge, all I need to see is some fish from right here in Sansi. Bring me a bellow guppy, a pebble eye, and a pillfish, and we're good. And remember, every species has its own habitat, so you'll have to search around to find where they live. But word to the wise, lot, lot of fish survive by nibbling on roots of plants. That should give you a place to start. I thank him and depart. Good luck out there. That's cool. Oh, uh, yeah. This is so cool! 
Hold on, I need to get a better vantage point to see if I... Roots of plants, roots of plants. There's plants! There's plants over here! There's plants over here! On it! On it! On it! We're gonna go fishing! Not... Not, not, not. Do I have to wait? Oh! I missed it! There was something, but I missed it. Hold on. Huh? Oh, god damn it! That's a- oh no, I already can tell I'm gonna be real bad at this fishing mechanic. Caught one! Bellow Guppy. It pulses its way through the sands using an air propulsion system that grows at the end of its tail. When frightened, the force of the propulsion can cause the bellow to drop off, leaving the fish stranded. That's cool. That's cool. That's, that's cool. I think having fish living under the sands is so unique. That's a very unique idea that I've not seen before. one fellow guppy um didn't i have notes didn't i have notes somewhere about how to catch fishies uh common sense of midden hard to miss <sighs> extremely common in the sand seas the herd of midden below pillars of rock seeks the souls of old bones the fish see green areas with trees and foliage Red Sea, uh, that's a lot of, that's just a lot of fish. We'll find them. Where's Simone? Simone? <laughs> Where are you, buddy? There we go. And what's this if I face down there? Where am I? What is that? That's not the bridge of the betrayed. What are you? Who? Oh yeah, that's something I haven't been to before. Let's explore it! Now that I think about it, I don't think I spent a lot of time in this first area. At all. I think I was just like, ooh, places, things, places, and immediately shot off to go look at other stuff. There's a strange purple glimmer about it. <laughs> What's that about? What is this? It's not anything I've been to before, definitely. Let me in. Oh, there's something glowing. What is this? Riddle me this! I just- I definitely just walked past this when I was first in this area. Yippee! 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 
Upon seeing the frankly humongous chum holding up the remains of an ancient stone tower, I nearly jump out of my skin. Before I collect myself, I hear a voice cooing in my head. Ah, oh, hello, wanderer. Please, don't be frightened. The giant chum cocks its head at me and chirps. Are you talking to me? I realize as I ask that this question is for my own benefit. I am talking to you as much as I am able to talk, and you're able to perceive my thoughts. But I assure you, I'm as real as you are. I hear you are carrying some of my children. I can feel the eggs squirming in my satchel at their mention. I relax suddenly, comforted by the absurdity of the situation. Your name is old and vast, like the desert. I mouth the syllables as it chirps silently. Sable, how beautiful. I don't have a name as such, but I am the queen of the chums. You may call me queen chum or chum queen as you prefer. I bow my head politely. It's an honor to meet you, queen. The queen seems surprised at my formality. Oh my, you're such a proper little human. Well, you being here feels very lucky indeed. Perhaps you could help us. Our eggs are scattered throughout the deserts, but they need to be planted somewhere safe. Bring them here, little one. I will be able to give you something for your favor. My answer comes without hesitation, a big yes. You're a kind little slug, aren't you? I think I'm going to like you, Sable. To start things off, bring me five eggs. I have them with me already. You've been so busy, so many of us together already. Excellent work, young Sable. The queen coos at me while her gentle voice resonates in my head. Oh, how fortunate for you to have taken an interest in us. I find myself smiling at this magnanimous compliment. You are a rare specimen in this age. Oh, cutscene? Chum Queen Tear. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, we're stacked. We have like 45 of these. Well, now, you've gotten me all emotional. Lucky for you, the tears of a chum carry great power. But I suggest you keep that information to yourself. I nod solemnly, sparing her any elaboration on her suggestion. The tear feels like a gift. I feel stronger, more resilient. Bring me 15 eggs next. Have them. I do. I do. Young Sable, so kind of you to visit again. You've helped us become quite a little collective. Her magic voice is like a cool towel on the back of my neck. All the little ones you've brought home are so thrilled to be part of a family now. I want a plushie of her. She's so cute. Hell, yes. Oh, yeah. Stamina increased. You spared them a life of solitude and distant wanderings. They're so grateful, even now, in their youth. I feel the power of the queen's tears buzzing within me, even as I hold back my own. Now, I'll need 20 eggs from you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the queen asked me if I have the eggs for her. Deliver eggs. Welcome back, Sable. The queen wriggles as she greets me silently. You've brought more of my children home. This is true kindness. As chums are not often on the receiving end of such thoughtfulness, your dedication to us is truly a boon. Although my face is covered, I'm sure the queen can feel my immense smile. What a genuine smile you have. Oh, stop. I'm getting emotional again. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Next, how many? 30? The queen coos at her brood. They do seem happier here, though I'm not sure how I can tell. I feel even stronger now with another of the queen's tears. Another 20, please. Oh, how lovely. Can I investigate these doors? Nope. Oh, I have so much stamina. Oh, this is so cute. This is adorable. How did I miss this? 
This is literally right next to the start. Whatever. With this much stamina? Life is gonna be a breeze. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Okay, what 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 else do we have in the quest? I need to catch a pebble eye. Any mention of those? Pebble eye. A common fish that seeks shade in the eastern dunes. North, south, east. East is this way? Maybe over here? Let's let's explore I guess there's a like a Okay. Let me we're gonna go from Actually that's barely closer. We'll just go from where we are. I think I'm on the right I'm going the wrong way. How am I already going the wrong way? Ex mix squeeze me? Okay. We can go to the one area that I couldn't go to before because I couldn't climb very far. Oh, it'll it, it's all so beautiful. It's all so good. Oh. We're working our way there. I want to just go around the back side of that uh, big hill or like that big cliff area on the map. What's that? Oh, that's okay. That's the station. All right. All right. All right. All right. Uh, okay. <laughs> I didn't make sure I was actually going in the right direction. Oh, yeah. I, I'm thinking back. I think as soon as I got into this area that I'm in currently, or as soon as I started the game, I got a tutorial area, went straight into this area, and then went to Ecria, and then, like, never turned back around to investigate anything. Ow. Sorry, Simone. I'm curious. I want to go fishing. This is new area. Let's go fishing. I accidentally sat down. Oh, shit. Annoying ass fish. Got him. A hummer, a bird like fish that often sur surfaces from below sands to consume food in its natural habitat of palm forests. They move with erratic and incredible speed. Cool. I'm right at the precipice here, so I gotta go left. <laughs> I wish I wish I could change the colors of the crystals on on Samoon to like match my little outfit here but such is life and such is plants that I can fish from hello uh 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 oh. <laughs> uh oh. We'll worry about that later.
Don't know what that was all about. Mm. Got a little too close to the edge of the world, it seems. Fuck. Oh, fuck. Hold on. Um... This should be, like, good. Annoying ass fish. Sandra- Oh! How cute! I love- I love, like, rays. This rare fish is held up as a sign of good luck in cultures across the dunes. They typically travel alone, a delicacy in Red Sea, but eating sand rays is frowned upon anywhere else. Oh, can I catch another one? If they're a symbol of good luck, maybe I could catch another one. Maybe I can sell it for quite a lot of money. No, I- Oh, I, I did catch another one. Ooh! Okay, I'm gonna take care this time to not, um... Not, uh... Veer off into the end of the universe. ETC, ETC. I, I'm like, I, I just want to keep fishing now. I'm so intrigued about the fishing mechanic. say just morning because if it really was a good morning I'd be fishing third sand ray how much are you worth I don't know I don't know if I could sell you even One of the advice things said a fish likes to eat or likes to sit near old bones. Fucking knew it. Fucking knew it. Knew there was gonna be one. Unless it's another sand ray, but. Oh! Hi there, buddy. Observing my surroundings. Okay, where are we now? We're getting near it. Okay. See, that's what I was thinking too, but I was like, oh, maybe, maybe it's just any bones, but... Or maybe I just cannot go this way. They lied when they said there's a, there's something there. They really don't want me going that way. Apparently. Uh, let's... Go here. <laughs> Why not? Why not? 
if we can climb, let's go here. Okay. I think I think maybe I'll save that for uh for next next stream of this. Cuz now I want to go on my climbing journey. Cuz I can actually do it this time. I believe in myself. I know I can do it. I can do it. I have all the stamina. Oh yeah, we're killing it. I even have to wait for the full thing to fill up. Ooh, ooh. It's time. Oh, there's plants. I wonder if I can fish. Uh, okay. Or I guess I can't. Oh, I guess I just can't fish up here. That's fair. You know what? That's fair. Oh yes. Oh yes, oh yes. I'm very intrigued at what's up here. I don't think I was able to visit any of the buildings. I think I was able to get to the cartographer and I got stuck on this plateau up here. For a second I was worried I would have just too little, but we're good. I reuse trousers. The split toe shoes makes make missteps a great at great heights less unlikely, and grips on the soles make exploration easier on foot. No no messages for me, just close. Alright. I'll take it, I'll take it. I can... Mm, can I? I can make it. There we go. Let me pop up here, see what's going on. I thought this might be like another city, but it looks like it's just an outpost of sorts. Hmm. 
as well. There's one here and there's one there. Curious. Let's go to the right first because there's smoke which indicates a living person. I would like to meet more people. And get more quests. Uh, I'm gonna take the time to fill up, fill up the extra stamina there. Don't mind if I do. Hello? There's someone. Hey there, how can I help you today? What is this place? It's an ancient Hikaric ruin. We found it a few years ago and I've been trying to get it back to life since. Cool, right? After we got the bird towers up and running, I spent a long time figuring out how to farm and engineer those big bones you see across the channels. That's how we navigate the rocks. Fair ourselves around. If you have a bike, I've got some interesting parts to sell. If you see Umi around, say hello. It's nice to see someone else up here. Um, I would like to trade with you. <laughs> Interesting. We got some boat parts. Thanks for stopping by. This is cool. Eh, that's really cool. Curious about these bird towers now. Is there perhaps a little friend at the top waiting for me? A worm, perhaps? Nope. <laughs> Definitely not. <gasps> there is one over there, though. I see you. Sneaky, sneaky. How many do I currently have? I have six, okay. Let's... Let me pop here. Let's make our way over to that last little one right there, and then I think... The boat. The boat that can float. Pretty cool. Can I get on it? Sidetracked. A little sidetracked, it's alright. Uh oh. <laughs> oh. I can't get around in it, but it's there. I think that's a good point to leave off. I think is what I was saying. Um let's pop on over here. Rooney, let's pop up here. Let us see. Oh, it's so nice not having to take the long route all the time because I have enough stamina to just scale it. Life is good. And I'm assuming this is Umi. Ooh, Iris Top. Perfect. We've traveled a long way. Not often we get travelers. Do you live up here? Only for parts of the year. The winds get rough and it becomes hard to stay. Better to get on the sands and sell up what we can in the hard ones. I do love it up here when the winds are steady. Nothing quite like riding a boat through towers of rock. 
The bird crap is the only downside. A profitable one, at least. Why are you out here? I'm just harvesting some of the bird excrement we get from these towers. You've traveled a long way. Okay. Well, you, you don't have butts to say, like the other one did. That. I go there? Carabs hold. Wait, what is that? Did I go there? I don't know if I did. And there's also... Something down here. Ah! I know what you are. Maybe we can get a little sidetracked. Did I get an achievement from that? I assume I did for for just like falling really far. All right. Oh, there's quite a few of these. Okay. It was just four. Even better. Let's uh, let's just go in there, and then that's where we'll end off for the day. I'm quite curious. I wonder if they'll give me another strange glowing ring that I don't know what to do with. <laughs> Ow! What do we got? 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 Another... Glowing ring! A Karak ring artifact. Lovely. Thank you. Alrighty. Oof. What? We got a lot. We we got a lot done today. Let me let me just say. We found the Queen Chum. We finished like three, four quests even. Uh yeah, we got it. Fuck it. We got a lot done. Damn. Damn. Well, um, let me pop on some music for us. Get us going. Ladies, gentlemen, gamers, thank you so, so much for coming out to stream today. I really do appreciate it. I hope you enjoyed. I did as always. I'm so glad I finally realized you can fast travel in this. Save, save, saves me a lot of um, strife there. <laughs> um, I am not quite sure if I will be streaming tomorrow or not yet. Uh, I am quite busy. However, I will let you guys know as usual in my Discord if I decide not to or things go differently. Um, otherwise, if I do stream tomorrow, I will definitely be playing some Ooblis. We're going to be taking a bit of a break from Sable, just because Ooblis got the Halloween stuff going on. I'm excited. I haven't played it in a while. Why not? Otherwise, I'm going to be raiding my good friend, Mono. He's currently streaming, uh, Tears of the Kingdom, but he's trying to play it without using a glider at all. Wish him, wish him the best of luck. Uh, I hope you all have a fantastic rest of your day, and bye bye Doo -doo.